Hi, I'm Callum Dilietto, editor of HR Grapevine magazine, and we're here today with Rafi Park to discuss why ethics are important in leadership. Uh, my name is Michael Jenkins. Uh, I'm chief executive of the Rafi Park Institute. Uh, why are ethics important? I think the quickest answer is that ethics are good for business. Uh, it's uh, something that will um, engender engagement in your people if they feel that they're part of an ethical organisation that behaves in an ethical way. Uh, it's going to be something that will help not only them uh, to be better at what they do, but also that will communicate it itself, itself to, to your clients. So ethics are good for business. I think they're good for the future. Uh, we uh, have discussed a little bit about the, uh, the younger generation, how important it is that uh, the organisation they plan on working for uh, is act actually ethical. And uh, for me personally, I think that's a, a great thing. Okay, uh, I'm Andrew Walsh, I'm Head of HR at the Pensions Trust. Um, and ethics in leadership is important to me because I fundamentally believe that leaders who behave with integrity with their workforces actually get more out of the workforce. So there is a, not only a, a moral um, reason for doing it, there, there's a distinct business advantage of doing it, that if you treat your employees in a way which um, reflects integrity and the values of the organisation, you get more out of them, you get more engaged employees, uh, and they're more productive employees. Um, Joe Healy, HR Director of Victim Support. Um, I think ethics are important in leadership uh, for one reason and one reason only. Um, it defines you as the leader. Um, what matters to most people is only one thing. What you say, what you do, and the gap between the two. And the gap between the two is defined by how closely your actions match your words. And your words are the ethics by which you live, and the actions are those by which you are defined and judged. Um, so I think ethics are really important um, on the basis that that's how most people judge you. Not because of what you say, but because what you do and how closely what you, say, what you do are aligned to what you say. Tracy Hammond, I work for Royal Mail and I'm Head of Engagement and People Development. So why do I think ethics is important in leadership? I guess it's simply just about doing the right thing. Can I go home at night and know that what I've done is right for myself and right for the people and right for the organisation? And at the bottom of that, I guess it's about compassion. Um, when, when we make decisions, we're making decisions for our staff, um, with our managers and for our customers. But we need to be compassionate and we need to know what we're doing is taking account of everybody's needs and it's about the wider society as a whole. So, you know, does it affect the bottom line? Yes, it does, because if you treat people right, then they treat the organisation right, and that affects our commercial bottom line. So it is worth investing in, and it is about being authentic. If you say you're going to do it, then you do it, but you do it for the right reason. And it's that basically simple for me.